was today and be seeing you how to play soccer. Also, by the way, do you see how far I'm Oh yeah, let's go get it. <laughs> but so today I'm be teaching you how to play soccer and also giving you a few tips of how to do it really well. And I didn't even do soccer myself, but I had a PE student teacher. Now at the middle school, but man, I'm actually really sad that he's gone, but. Oh, All right, well, thank you for your background story, continue. <laughs> but so, uh, so I'm gonna give you tips and tricks how to get really well at soccer, even if you start out really bad like I did. So, first, you wanna learn how to take control of the ball. You don't want to do that. But so, first thing you wanna learn Most time you're gonna dribble. Do you be basketball dribble? I know. A lot of you come to mind as a basketball dribble. But oh, NBT. We are gonna a dribble in soccer is when you use big toe and your pinky toe. Or at least that's what I call it. To <laughs> dribble it like this. Sometimes when you do dribble it like you dribble it like this. You will use your wedge, which is what we call this. And then you just stop right here. I did this. I stomped on the book, is what we like to call it. Stomp on the book. Except that time, that didn't work. I sort of stomp on the book. Squashy. And then the other thing is our student teacher taught us is uh, we have a ballerina, soccer player. So you stop it like this, so if it's coming at me, it's gonna stop. Want me to kick it to you? Sure. Just pass it. Alright, so it's gonna pass it to me. I'm gonna use this soccer player. Alright, now I'm gonna do stomp on the ball. Stop on the bug. And hey, then, you killed the bug. Good job. Alright, and then. One thing also you'll need to know is how to um, how to uh, pass it. Cause you're not even gonna pass the ball every time like with your toes. No, but for have good powerful kicks like I do, it's not gonna work. It's gonna go flying. So, and your opponent doesn't want to get your own teammate doesn't want to get smacked in the face by your ball. That's why I'm 40 miles an hour. So you want to pass, but guess what? You're wedge. So you're going to pass a pass. Do it again. So that's how you did that. You know what thing? Also need to know is how to like dribble it really well and get there fastly. All right, show us how you can dribble really well, like that, but except without. And then you can also practice this at home, where you just roll the ball. And I stop. Don't stop it. Move. All right. Go All to right. the side. All right. So where you just roll it. you use your right leg are you just not talented enough or is it better to use non-dominant hands uh honestly i can do both because my skill 
request for it from my teacher, but uh, we'll just have to see. Or another another soccer, soccer video. Another soccer? Whatever you want. Piano? I'll see. Piano? Or even if you want. Star Dark series, our channel. Or do you want me to to do more karate videos? Like, uh, do. Uh, yeah, sure well, not Pete on Chodon, but I will do second form, third form, fourth form for you. You've already showed the second and third form. No, I only showed the first. <laughs> you showed second and third form. I'll, uh, I'll show Pete on Chodon. And show if you want to add something else for a cry video. Yeah, well, I might teach how to punch it correctly. I don't know yet. So, basketball videos. Uh, any sports videos, honestly. We'll see what we can do for those. But, comment down below what you want us to do. See ya! See ya next time on Shooting and Whips! Like and subscribe for more YouTube videos. Bye! Maggie, out. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? I lost her. Well, that's the end of that video. Hope you guys enjoyed. See ya next time. What's that?